just adult to adult, I am really concerned about your judgment and putting yourself in harm's way. If you meet people over the internet and then you go meet them in the real world, particularly somewhere private, mm -hmm. like a parking lot in a car, that's just dumb. Well, this was all in October of I last don't year. Care. I got brains since then. Okay, look, I don't spoke, d listen. I found a friend that I could actually confide in and yeah. spoke to. And so but Kimberly, in October listen, of last I, year, I, I've gotten I, brains since I, then. I do a lot of shows regarding the internet. And there are some weird cats really, I on the few, internet. I and okay. you don't want to be putting yourself in harm's way. Right. And if you're going out and meeting men. I had nobody or nowhere to go, and now I do. And that has been a huge blessing. What that I'm this has telling all come you. Because it's been good. Well, I'm glad you consider it a blessing. What I'm telling you is this you don't owe them an explanation, but you do owe yourself consideration. Right. Do not degrade yourself by meeting men in parking lots. Do not right. degrade yourself by putting yourself out there. Do not disrespect your marriage and your family by turning away from your partner if you've got problems. Deal with that with him. And, we are and if now. that doesn't work out, then maybe it's time to shut that marriage down. That's another question for another day. But you won't find solutions by putting yourself in harm's way degrading yourself, and who knows, their legitimate concern is that you cross a line and allow people to know where you are and where you live, yeah, and some crazy wacko comes yeah, over there while you're watching the children, and they are in harm's way. Right. And that's where they do have a legitimate Agreed. concern. You need to make sure they understand you get that and that you are not crossing those boundaries. You can get killed by dealing with these people on the internet, and you need to stop doing right, that. Right, that's why I did. Straight out. That's why I did. Not because they judge you, but because you're putting yourself in you harm's know, way. And do you agree like that, with you what I'm to. telling her? I, I totally agree. So okay. I'm actually supporting a substantial part of your position, that if she, if she blurs the boundaries, then family members, you, others, could be in harm's way. Don't well, like do said, this that was in and don't... October of last year, so and since do then... do not degrade yourself by meeting strange people in a parking lot. I promise you that won't give you what I, you're looking I for. If you're bored, out. get a hobby. I figured it out. But your hobby is not... Bike. Your hobby is not... <laughs> your hobby is not meeting weirdos in a parking lot. Because some I guy that will come agree. meet a woman in a parking lot is not the quality man. if anybody's man. watching that wants to do that, don't do it. Yeah, it's not well, worth it. Don't do it. Okay, save yourself before the world. Yeah.